Today we are in the art district here in Las Vegas, Nevada. We decided to go into the antique mall just to check it out. I've been in here before, but Delvin has not. I wanted to show him around and look at all the cool different things that they have. You can literally spend hours in this place. Everything you can purchase. They had, you know, everything that you can ever imagine. Um, it's actually pretty interesting to look at. Uh, all the clothes was very, you know out there i loved every single one of it the dress was different i figured that would be like cute for a little photo shoot i really like this piece and it was my size like i was thinking maybe for halloween or something like that i might have to go back um the crowns are gorgeous look at this old i uh, uh ah, the old phone <laughs> that art piece everywhere i really like this little corner i want to design my next spot like this um it's pretty cool maybe not everything but with the neon lights and all that you know they had millions of old license plate and it was all like cali colorado more bling more clothes sequins different fabrics obviously you can you know do something different with that this guy we gave him a nice tip because he was playing that saxophone today we are at casa don don juan Devin and I decided to come down to the art district today and check it out. So they have indoor and outdoor seating. Um, and also from Monday through Friday, breakfast, they have some specials. Lunch, we just made it for lunch. So we got the chimichanga plates for $3.99. Um, and then from three to six, it is also happy hour. So keep that in mind. Here are the margarita options. Mmm, Monday through Thursday, three to six. Okay, so I got the chimichanga with extra sour cream. There's guac on the side and it comes with rice and beans. Delvin got the same thing. Their salsa here is actually really good. Is it? Their salsa is actually really good. All right, so let's try it out. I'm just gonna pick it up with my hands and take a bite. Look at all that cheese in there. Mmm, mm. that cheese pull? Mmm. Mm hmm. You like it? I do. This is actually Dublin's first time having a chimichanga, isn't it? I think it is. I believe so. Mm, look at the big bus Las Vegas. I want to take the big bus Las Vegas tour. I do too. I asked for some habanero, so I'm kind of waiting for that. I'm not going oh. too crazy. Oh, yeah. You're right. I need some hot sauce. Oh, you want some too? Oh, want Maybe some one of those are okay. Yeah, this is cool. Everything came so fast. Yeah, they, they literally came without water within the like, first, what? We ordered our food, literally it took like seven minutes to come out. Yeah, like two seconds. I, I wanted to order maybe a margarita and like chill for a second, but I also wanted to put in the order right away because um, it was like five minutes until the lunch special was over. So, and which I'm kind of upset because they actually have like, after the lunch special, they have a happy hour. Well, one of their happy hour meals is five El Pastor tacos served with French guacamole, plain cilantro, and spicy salsa. Yeah. That sounds better for me. Yeah, I sh they should hand that with. Oh, you went crazy. I know. Mm -hmm. Hold on, let me get a fork. Okay, this is kind of hard to do with holding my phone. Yeah, I didn't yeah. bring the correct, um, no, it's okay. Mm -hmm. I didn't bring the correct um, tripod because mm -hmm. um, I figured I can just stand it up. Or I didn't know what we were doing actually, but I'm gonna try to taste the beans and rice together. Mm. I'm gonna try to. Thank you. Really good. It's 
really, really good. Okay, now I have you guys a little bit, a better setup going on and I can actually use both my hands to eat. So yeah, these are delicious actually. I'm really, really enjoying this. Um, I love how much cheese is inside. Yeah. Mm. And you didn't even see the wall of how many freaking flavors they have for margaritas. I didn't see that. They have like blueberry. Mmm. Um, yeah, I knew you would like that one. Blueberry, pomegranate, lime, um, just all different kinds. I love everything blueberry. Mm-hmm. We're eating outside. The only thing about eating outside is these birds are savages. Yeah. Literally when the coast take in zero, a bird jumped on the table. Me and him had to throw hands after that one. <laughs> mm. Yeah, but I figured we should eat outside because it's just such a beautiful day. It is a beautiful day out here. Finally. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we needed it. I've been just, I've been really wanting just a nice, hot, bright, sunny day. Yeah. I would love to go to a pool right now. Now when Vegas pop out with 100 degrees, <laughs> how you gonna feel it? Mm. I said, oh, you want a nice and bright and sunny back here. Get a Honda. <laughs> mm -hmm. There's no happy meeting. I'm not gonna be complaining. Mm -hmm. Once it starts, I better get my butt back in the gym because once it starts getting hot outside, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be outside. Mm -hmm. That's the only thing about eating outside, it's windy too. Yeah, it's really windy. Oh, so the reason why we came here actually was because I was going to, well, I was thinking about getting one of those $10 tattoos. Mm -hmm. It's right across the street. Yeah. <clears throat> um, but we actually walked, like took a peek inside and um, there's a lot of people in there right now. This is actually packed. I'm surprised there's that many people who even know about this area, to be honest. Mm -hmm. I mean, everybody knows about $10 tattoos in Vegas, but they got places on the strip that do it too. Yeah, there's different locations. There's multiple locations. Um, and is it just the pink ones? Oh, Or do a uh, different, uh, you know? I'm not sure, because I never really, like, uh, looked into it, but I'll be shocked if all these are tourists. Out here in the Arts District, mm -hmm. I feel like it's not a, tourists won't know about this as much unless yeah. you really rock with Vegas or coming out a lot. Right, right. No, this place actually reminds me of a little bit. Um, this place in Houston, they were like uh, almost like a Plato's Closet, which they have their own here in Nevada. Mm -hmm. um, theirs is called. Do you remember? Uh, I don't remember. Um. I know they have exchange. Oh yeah, Buffalo Exchange. Okay. So they have Buffalo Exchange, and then in um, Houston they had. Oh, I can't remember what it is called, but on the outside it's like that cheetah print painted. So that's kind of what this area looks like. It's really dope down here. They have a lot of like old vintage Vegas stores. Um, and down here, I didn't even take you to it because I've been here, um, like right when we moved here, I kind of took a stroll down here, but it was really hot. And so anyways, um, down in this little vintage, like rummage sale kind of thing, um, or thrift store, they sell also, um, like old costumes, mm. like the, the head dresses and all that. Mm. I think that'd be so cool. <laughs> If you got like a like a artsy apartment here, yeah. Well, they have this um, this vintage store that sells two TVs and stuff. Mm -hmm. I love you kind of go outside. I haven't seen the two TVs I feel like in ages. I know, I know. When's the last time you actually felt and touched two TVs? Um, honestly, I don't even know. <laughs> Think about it. That's crazy. How isn't it kind of crazy too? Like how things kind of like go not not even it's not going out of style. It's just like. How they disappear. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
like they got so recycled out of time, no one has one no more. I almost crazy it. I don't know. And it's crazy too, just how technology gets better over time, how stuff just becomes cheaper because <laughs> look, uh, literally by a 15 inch flat screen, for like a hundred bucks probably. Yeah, you know? yeah. And I don't say 15 inch because I'm trying to think of something small like a tube TV, you know? Yeah, that's basically like a computer screen, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. um, what's funny is that <laughs> I was scrolling through Facebook this morning and it says, if a girl says come over for Netflix and chill, and it was the Netflix screen, but on like a little, not tube. not even, I mean, yeah, it was a tube TV, but it was like one of those small ones that your grandma had in the oh, kitchen. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he said, I am not going on. Oh my god. That's not good. <laughs> so these are guys good? Yes. Yeah. Appreciate it. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Oh my gosh, Shay's gorgeous outside. I was like, you know, this is like I don't know, I just felt like we should have took it take advantage of today. Yeah, I facts. believe it's supposed to rain in like maybe two days or something. I know like this weekend is gonna be in the sixties. Uh, mm -hmm. Vegas is like there's no happy medium. It's either cold, mind you, 50s and 40s is cold. <laughs> yeah. For us now. And then, uh, yeah, or it's, like, or it's I'm either like, dumb hot. You know? Mm hmm. But, um. Oh, and last night was a full moon. It was. Oh, what are you? Like, I'm like, oh, hey, hey, hey. Mm hmm. I kind of want a margarita. Would you get blueberry? Oh. If you get one margarita, what do you get to do? One margarita. Mm. <laughs> oh, I did you taste the um what do you think of the water? Mm. It has a very strong I don't like it. You think so? I don't like it at all. Maybe if I squeeze some lemon. I just found thirsty. I'm, mm -hmm. I am too. And I'm so mad because I left, I brought my bottled water and it's in my car. Yeah. I mean, it's not too far, but I'm not running all the way down there. Yeah. I should have told him about the water. Um, trying to come out in the wild. That's the only thing too about sitting outside. It's hard. They haven't come out outside of line unless there's a lot of customers out here. Yeah, and we're like the only ones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I noticed there's a lot of people out here with their cameras. Yeah. A lot of photographers and videographers. Yeah. They're doing their thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Is he feeding those birds? Yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah. So what do you think of everything? It's decent. Got home. I like this place overall. Timmy Chong is really not my thing. I should have so got the street tacos. Like... But I just did. What the hell did today? <laughs> I try something new. Step on my comfort zone. Mm. Oh, don't forget, you know you got sour cream. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, but their chips and salsa, oh, I want to taste their nacho. Yeah. Yeah, their their uh, their salsa is pretty good. I should I should have asked them if they had some kind of green salsa. Oh. Okay, so we got our margaritas. 
It's margarita time. Woo! Woo wee! This will have you singing the margarita song. <laughs> I like it. I like mine. Let me taste. Did you get salt or sugar? I think mine is a salt rim. I mean, sugar rim. I don't like the salt rim. I think mine is a little heavy on the the uh, mixer. Oh, yours is really good. Mine does. I like yours. Matter. Yours is very limey. Like very limey. I like yours. Once we were done eating, we walked down the street and found this really cool art slash art museum slash shop, I guess you can call it that. Um, all of the art was for sale. So this right here was an old Coca-Cola machine with stickers all over it. They sold some paintings that people have done. Um, those you can frame they sell some mystery bags with t-shirts and stickers in there you never know what you're gonna grab those are also just some little cool cutouts these are like mini canvases that you can buy for ten dollars some cards this room was really dope because it was like an outside street um like almost in like new york a back alley type of vibe there was all different pictures of robots and those are all old vcr tapes and like discs for older computers i thought this was very interesting this place is dope so i feel like if you you know got dressed up and went in there and took a few pictures for instagram it'd be cool next we went into the rebar down the street this is dope the all of the art on the walls is actually for sale as well they have a happy hour that are um three to five dollar drinks depending on what you get they offer some cool games so you can play with your friends there's me sipping on my cocktail then there is an outside that you can take pictures in this photo booth i hope you guys enjoyed um please like and subscribe share you guys know the deal